Today is Thursday, April 11th, 2024. I just came inside from shooting the April drill of the month. Uh, for this uh, month, I chose a range master drill from Tom Givens. It's called the playing card drill. Now, disclaimer here, I've never trained with Tom Givens. I've never met with Tom Givens. I don't have a photograph of me with Tom Givens, uh, but I did buy his book, Concealed Carry Class. It's an awesome book. Uh, I highly recommend it. But uh, Tom Givens has designed a ton of drills that are out there. Uh, probably his most famous is the casino drill. This is not the casino drill that requires a special target. All this requires is basically a cheap deck of cards from a dollar store and a shot timer. So basically the rules are uh, you shoot this at five yards. You have five seconds to draw from concealment and get five hits on the playing card. It's just simply pass fail. You got to make the time less than five seconds. You got to get all five hits. Uh, so to make this interesting, uh, you know, everybody know, that knows me know I shoot a 1911 by choice. Uh, but I do own other guns and do occasionally shoot other guns. So to make this a little bit more interesting, I shot this with my SIG 225, P225, 9 millimeter. It's a single stack eight shot gun. This Plicker one was made in 1987. At one time, this was the official sidearm of the federal police in Switzerland, Austria, and West Germany. Uh, you don't see them around much anymore, but this one's in almost brand new condition and it shoots really well. But the first shot, double action, is probably, I don't have a trigger gauge, but it's probably 12 or 14 pounds. It's really a pretty stiff uh, first shot. And then it switches to single action mode and it's probably about four pounds um, for each trigger press after that. So this is not a particularly hard drill unless you're shooting it in the pouring rain. So this morning uh, it's actually been alternating between pouring and, and just a steady downpour. Uh, but I decided, hey, let's try to shoot a drill of the month in adverse conditions. So I shot this from concealment. Uh, I was actually wearing my Kramer uh, MSP paddle holster. This is a a uh, holster from the 1990s I used to carry um, when I was a young assistant prosecutor. I carried a very similar SIG in this holster, and this was actually designed uh, for by Kramer Leather Company for the Michigan State Police uh, Plainclothes Division. So it's a really nice uh, concealment holster. Uh, so I shot this uh, with my SIG 225 uh, Federal 115 grain uh, nine millimeter ball ammo, and uh, as you can see there I got all five hits. So the trick here uh, is you got to make the time, but you don't want to shoot it so fast that you'll miss the card. Uh, so I had to kind of focus on getting a good draw, a good grip, pressing that double action pull all the way through to the rear to get that thing to fire and then not go too fast. So you see here, I recorded my times. My draw time to the first shot was 2.15 seconds. And then my split was 58 for the second shot and then 44 hundredths of a second for the third shot. You can see I gradually increased my pace, accelerated there, and then finished at 387. So I well made the, easily made the time, uh, got my five hits in there. Uh, if you're shooting like a single action 1911 or a gun with a dot, this would be probably a lot easier, but I decided I want to try it with um, a more challenging gun under more challenging circumstances. And the rain didn't really affect it, just it's, um, I guess it's kind of incentive, like, hey, let's get this done so we can get out of the rain. Uh, so anyway, <clears throat> that's the drill of the month for April. Uh, I really enjoyed it. I hope you do as well. All right, time was 387 and I got all five hits.